Well, hey folks, Fat Guy Flies RC out here at the Avon Park Field. We're going to take up the Free Wing MiG-29 Fulcrum uh, Twin 80, running two 5,000 HRBs with 60C discharge. The rates I'm flying in are 100% throws over 30% expo all the way around. And the flap system, there's no elevator to flap mix. Flaps up are negative 100%, no mix. Takeoff flaps, Take which let flaps. me get turned where you can see takeoff flaps are a negative 20 and landing landing flaps are a positive 30. Flaps all right so let's go ahead and put our takeoff flaps in because we've lost all of our wind timer set for four minutes uh, i've already done the already geared this or cycled the gear one time right left up down right left Got the KM model afterburner in there, double KM model for their version four. And this is a very, very powerful plane. All right. But she's actually a big sweetheart, too. You hear me, sweetheart? You better be a big sweetheart. <laughs> Don't get jealous of camera pressure. She's your number one. All right. Takeoff flaps are in. Timer set for four minutes. Here we go. I have the AS3X Plus enabled, is what I've got the receiver set up for. Also, I've got the nose, uh, nose gyro. I'm going to take it out, flip it. All right. We'll bring it back towards us. About three quarters throttle right now. Turn it off. Bring by, I want to see the belly. I want to make sure all my gear is down, everything's down. And it is. Start setting up my approach for a landing. Remember, this is a big plane. And we'll just take off from down there. Take off flaps. Take off flaps. I'm going to test out that nose gear or that nose gear uh, gyro. See how I like it. I like it. I do have the Spectrum satellite in there, just so you know. I can see all my gears down. Do not get too slow with her in the turns. Right 
All right. One minute. All right. One minute left. We're going to push it. Going to take off from down there. No takeoff laps. Huh. I took off with my take with my landing flaps. Thirty seconds. Braking. Brakes are off. Never took my landing flaps off when I took off. Well, that's okay, she did just fine. Swallow your pride about staying on the on the real on the runway. Don't do something, try to get her to turn or something before she's ready, just for the sake of you staying on the runway. Remember, your pride will not buy you a new plane. Picked up a little hitchhiker on that one wheel. All right. All right. We were two seconds shy of a four minute timer and sweetheart, you'll have to come to this one. Okay. Prop secured. Prop secured. Now, with this plane, you can put your five thousands. I got one here. If you go any further forward, you're going to interfere with the battery, uh, the hatch. So that's about perfect. The other one, you just put it back here. Now, if you want to run the battery at th this five thousand up here, then you'll need to shove this five thousand a little further back to get your CG. But this plane here is so big and heavy that. <laughs> I hate to say the CG doesn't matter, but it because it definitely does with a jet or with any plane really. But for some reason, I can put the 5,000 there and put the five, and then she just CG is just fine. CG marks are molded in the wing. If you look for this middle panel line right here, you feel right underneath there. That's where your CG mark is. You see a little fill mark of that directly underneath there is a CG. Let me just show you. Gears down, I know, but uh, and she's hard to check CG because she's so big and heavy, but uh, you just do the best you can. And she's pretty good right there, maybe favoring nose heavy, but that's okay on the, with a windy day. Um, I'd rather be perfectly level, but hey, you take what you can get because she's a big, big plane, big heavy plane, good flying plane. Don't be intimidated by her size. She flies really well, but she is very powerful. So you have to remember that. And you've got two, Two big batteries sucking down juice. So let's check the CG or check the uh, battery port while we're here. Um, I plug the afterburner into the front one, and then the back one runs the U back. So you've got so that so this one's going to be a little bit lower, not much, but just a little bit lower, because it's running the U back, which runs all the electronics. Twenty-three percent, and this one. 20%. See? Just a little bit more. So, four minutes is all you want to do on two 5,000. I've ran her on dual 4,000s before, but only two and a half minutes then. Okay? Because you'll, I'm sorry, just three minutes then, because you'll suck them 4,000s really down quick. You can run 5,000s, uh, but she just gets so piggish. 5,000 is perfect. 5,000 here, 5,000 there. And on this canopy, Make sure all your wiring is, everything is within these white channels. You see these white channels? Make sure everything is within these white channels. You may have to, like I've done, have to carve out a little bit of foam, shave a little off the sides, but you'll have to kind of massage that canopy on there. Make sure, kind of 
kind of press it in there, make sure everything, and then make sure that pin is all the way forward. If that pin, it's got a long pin. If it's not all the way forward, your canopy is going to come off. This fuselage will flex a little bit. So if you'll just step back. Well, anyways, folks, there you go. That is the free wing double 80 millimeter MiG-29 Fulcrum. Incredible flying plane. Let me give you a little bit of a size comparison just so you get an idea. Oh, she, she's big, she's heavy. Uh, she's not as big as like a big old composite jet, but you know, I'm five foot 10 on a good day. So you can get an idea of the size of this plane. She's not, she's not a little plane. This is not a park flyer. This is a full-fledged park, full-fledged AMA field you need to be in to fly this, this baby. But I'll tell you what, if you've got the situation and you've got the funds to get one of these, very rewarding, very rewarding. And the gear failed on me when I first bought it. Motion RC took care of me and shipped me out all brand new gear. So if you've got a problem, just take some pictures, make a little video, say, hey, here's what happened. And I'm telling you right now, if you operate in good faith with them, Motion RC will, will help you out. They'll work with you. But you got to work with them too. All right? Folks, thank you for watching. God is good. And that is the MiG-29 Fulcrum from Free Wing. And this is Fat Guy Flies RC saying God bless each and every one of y'all. And don't forget, stay family and friends in the MiG-29s. Bye-bye.